Welcome everyone, this is Kathy Bartoli from the Intimacy Dojo, and we're here with Reed Mahalko from readaboutsex.com. Mm-hmm. Dating profiles today. It's a great topic, because a lot of people don't have a clue how to write them or filter people, and so either they don't, because they have no idea what they're doing, or they write something really innocuous, and then people have no idea who they are, so they're not attracted to them. So, Reed, what's the first question you can ask to filter people and see if they're a good match or not? Um, well, because I'm a sex geek, I mean, basically I'm like, you know, do not send me naked pictures of you. Yes. Um, and then if they send you a naked picture, they're off the list yes. immediately. You, that, they just did you a favor. Um, so basically creating some sort of, not hoop necessarily for them to jump through, mm -hmm. but you want to know that they're paying attention, that mm -hmm. they're actually reading, um, and they got it. So some sort of, you know, before you tell me anything about yourself, answer this one question, you know, and, and if they, if you get a reply and they don't answer that question, mm -hmm. you don't need to read any further. Yeah. You know, whatever that question is for you, you know, what are your, you know, if this is my favorite like dinner conversation question, but, um, and, and please feel free to steal this. Um, you know, if, if I couldn't learn anything more about you via the internet, what are three books you would want me to read to get to know who you are as a person? Yeah. And then if that person doesn't send you, within the first couple of paragraphs, those three books, like you know that they didn't, they're, they're not paying attention. Yes. So you just need to frame it that way. Mm -hmm. um, whatever that ends up being for you, it's something that's engaging and you're really just kind of creating a hoop so that if they don't follow through on something like that, you can just really have the peace of mind to cross them off your list. Mm -hmm. I like what you said, Don't please don't send me naked pictures. You, I put that near the top of my profile because I was getting a lot of naked pictures and mm -hmm. it was not what I was looking for. Um, putting something like, I'm a bigger woman, I put that right at the top. Could, could we have a question or something about that that would help filter people? Um, yeah, I mean, you can basically say, you know, I mean, the way that I do it when I'm, when I'm advising people on profiles is say the scary stuff. Mm -hmm. Because if you scare them away, that's perfect. Like, no, that's very vulnerable because you're like, oh, what if I scare everybody away? Honestly, you're probably not going to scare everybody away. Um, so I, I, I did think it would scare everyone away to put at the top of my profile, I'm a big woman. If you don't want to date big women, please don't email me. And what was your experience? I got a lot of responses. I had to actually tighten up my ads so I was getting to filter out people because yeah. I was getting more people than I could actually go out with. And, and did the, uh, you know, don't send me naked pictures, did that help? It definitely, if they send me a naked picture, then I know that they're not paying yeah. attention. It's near the but top. But did it, did it actually cut down on the amount of naked pictures? It did cut down on the amount of naked pictures. Okay, now if you're into naked pictures, just put at the top, please send me a naked <laughs> picture. And if they don't send you one, then you can cut them out. You can specify what you, how you want it. Send closed. me a picture of your left foot. <laughs> if you need any help writing your profile or getting out there dating, Reed is an amazing coach and I do some coaching too. Oh, yeah. no, thank you. Um, so, call me, I'll give you bad advice. You're crazy. She's way saner. Saner, not necessarily. I mean, you, you gave me some great advice getting out there and I really appreciate it. Thanks. So, love sharing it with people. Get out there and date. Yeah, have fun. Thanks, Reed. You're welcome. Stop. Stop. <laughs>